Hey guys, what's going on? It's Carl here back with another episode. We've got something very sweet today in the studio. I have been looking forward to these two for the past year. None other than the new... None other than the brand new GoPro Hero 4 Black and Hero 5 Session. It is finally GoPro time. Before we get into these two unboxings, we do have a winner from the Best Buy Wearables Tech Event. Samuel Lagunjo, hoping I pronounced your name right. You are getting some sweet stuff from Best Buy Mail to you right after I'm done taking a look at these guys. Congrats, bud. And for everyone else, I've got a little iPhone 7 slash 7 plus giveaway going on. I think there's around two weeks left. I will leave that up here. Make sure you enter. And I'm considering also giving some of these guys away. So smash that like button if you wanna see this happen. All right, enough of me rambling. Let's get to the Hero 5. Five this time, black. I can't really remember. It's been a while. It's been a while since I met you. We've got pretty traditional GoPro boxing here. Let's take that first one off. And we see the Hero 5 black sitting right on top. Out pops the black. And inside we do have we finally have USB-C as the official charging cable. They're moving away from, it wasn't micro USB, it was older than that, and if you lost that cable, it was the biggest headache. Thank God. We've got a couple mounts, a couple rail systems, and of course, in the black, we do have a replaceable battery, whereas in the Session 5, it's a built-in battery. One of the differences. Switching on over to the Session first cut. Butchered. We've got this nice little tab here, very iPhone-esque. I wonder if they all collaborated on their unboxing experiences. Popping that off, this should now slide out. It's supposed to be a professional unboxer. Obviously, I need some work. Okay, session is out of the box. Session pops off, there it is. Okay, so we have the same basic rail systems, USB-C type cable, of course no battery, and inside just the standard accessories, very basic stuff. So the two major differences between these guys, the first of course being price, this one starts at $399 for the Hero 5 Black, the Hero 5 Session, $100 cheaper, couple other differences listed on the box, mainly doing with frame rates. On the 5 Black, we've got a 12 megapixel sensor, good for 30 FPS burst. On the 5 Session, we've only got a 10 megapixel sensor. For video, the main use, 4K at 30 FPS, 1440 at 80, 1080p at 120 FPS on the 5 Black. On the 5 Session, also 4K 30, but 1440p at 60 FPS, 1080p at 90 FPS, so slightly better frame rates over on the black. We also have, of course, a touch screen, better battery life, and really it comes down to what you're using these GoPros for. The Session 5 is naturally smaller, more compact, perfect for sticking on to, say, your helmet, a bit more concealed, whereas the 5 Black, if you want the extra features, you want the touch screen, it all comes in this nice, slightly larger package. And you can see the rest of the features on the black box. They both have video stabilization, which is nice. Of course, the 5 Black has touch display with the touch screen, stereo and audio mic inputs, which is super useful if you're into your audio game, because that is very important. And the last kicker here, which is huge for you professionals out there, you can record raw, which is key. Both are still waterproof up to 10 meters, and now on the Hero 5 Block, you can grab an additional underwater or a deep water case for all you deep sea divers out there that wanna go further than 10 meters, and it adds extra waterproof protection. Other than that $100 price difference and the extra frame rates on the Block, I don't see too many differences between the session. I love how compact this is. Interesting to see how the video footage holds up. I'll be sure to do a full test comparison between both of these guys, so make sure you stay tuned to the channel. And as I said, if you wanna see one of these as a giveaway, you might get some stock footage of me testing these out, and who wouldn't want that? Anyways, that will wrap up my super short unboxing and setup of the brand new GoPro Hero 5s. Make sure you stay posted for the full review slash comparison between them. Smash the like button as it helps me out a ton. 
and I'll catch the rest of you in either one of my next episodes or in one of my vlogs. Peace.